gentlemen, we'd like to welcome you to the West Coast Regional Championship. We've got quite a lineup today with some of the greatest skateboarders in America. All competing for a spot in the semifinals. the boards and moves into first place. Ruben! Oh, hey Sammy. What were you doing? Just screwing with this game. The dude's such a poser. That's still no reason to... Hey, uh, I gotta go, huh? Hasta luego. You avoiding us, Ruben? Huh, <laughs> Chato. No, I I'd never do that, Holmes. Of course you wouldn't, muchacho. We've nominated you for membership in our little club. Back off, Chato! You okay, cuz? Yeah, of course I'm okay, Tony. Uh, these guys are my friends. Uh, my neighbors. Some friends you got there. Hey, I got no fight with you, Valdez. But your cuz here lives in our hood. So what? We're only concerned with his safety, Holmes. It's not so safe to be a loner. Ruben's not your homie. And I don't want you bothering him anymore, comprende? Tony! They're starting! You're back, dude! Hurry! Cool. I'm through here. <laughs> hey, uh, hey, Tony! Wait up! <laughs> Hey there, Sammy. Que pasa? I saw you out there, Tony. Feeling all macho now. Grr! Oh, that was nothing. Hey, check out my board. The deck's all banged up. Yeah, I kind of noticed. So, how about a new deck, Sammy, huh? Uh, I think I can hook you up. Here, try this. See this? I reshaped the deck for maximum wind flow, then jiggered the trucks for these new urethane wheels I designed, which should provide smoother turning. Then I... Okay, I get it. You're a genius. Hola, Tony. Sammy! Mama! Papa! Didn't know you were coming. Antonio, you seem so excited in la mañana. We wanted to see. <laughs> so, this is what you quit college for? Jorge, we're here to root for Antonio, not to lecture him. Esto es importante. Gracias, Mama. Yes, important. Yes, yes. This is all fine for right now. But what about your future? I was hoping you would one day join us in our research. Like Sammy has. Papa, I just don't have the same interest in science and robotics as you do. It bores me. Our research helps a lot of people. Yeah, that's great. But I just want to ride my board. And whether you get it or not, this is what I care about. Next up is the winner of the West Coast Regionals two years in a row, Tony Valdez. Okay, look, I really got to go. Antonio, before you go, I want you to have this. This has been in La Familia for many generations. It has always brought us luck. Your condor necklace. <laughs> Gracias, mamá. Te quiero mi, Antonio. Go and win. We'll talk more later. No doubt. Love you guys, too. Let's go, Jorge. Ladies and gentlemen, Southern California's own, Tony Valdez! To admit, our Antonio seems to be very good at this roller skateboarding. See, he's very good. I just worry about his future. This self indulgent attitude of his is not good. I know, but he's young. He's never had to struggle for anything. Sometimes I worry we made things too easy for him. <laughs> George, Maria. 
I have the hardest time tracking you two down. Wow! That is amazing! Nigel, that's my Antonio. I never would have imagined that skateboarders are such wonderful athletes. Why are you here, Nigel? I've been contacted by some people that are very interested in our research. I wanted to see if I could convince you to speed up your tests, George. Valtech Robotics is committed to not taking shortcuts in testing. If we are to help people and not harm them, we have to make sure we are very thorough. Now, if you don't mind, I'm watching my son um, grinding some copes. George, I really need to... Okay. Mr. Valdez. Yes? I have some important information regarding your mm. business partner. Really? You'll want to examine a folder that I've uploaded to your company computer. <sighs> okay, I'll be right there. Something important has come up. I have to leave. Now? But Antonio's turn is almost finished. It can't wait. I'm sure Tony and Sammy can drive you back. We'll talk later. I hope so, George. I'd really like the opportunity to change your mind. Adios. <laughs> and Tony Valdez moves easily into first place. You did it! All right! Was there ever any doubt? Tony, you're the best, dude! Tony Valdez, for the third straight year, you've won the prelims for the Southland's best skater. What are you going to do now? I'm going to GA Sports on 3rd and Main for SoCal's best skateboarding gear. <laughs> and cut. That was great, Tony. I'll see you tomorrow at the finals, huh? Tony Valdez. I've had my eye on you, and I like what I've seen so far. Love your moves. Got any others? Um, who are you? Valeria. And I publish the biggest extreme sports magazine around. I've decided to make you a superstar. I'll pick you up for dinner, and we can discuss it over breakfast. Muy predido. And Dad said I was wasting my time as a skateboarder. <laughs> Lower your flag, Valdez. Huh? Tomorrow, you going down. The championship and that fine lady's gonna be all mine. You heard her. I'm a superstar. <laughs> yeah, right. This is exciting. We can talk all about it as you and Sammy drive me back to work. That's cool. Come on, let's go. Karai! He knew these weren't ready to test on humans. What was he thinking? What was who thinking? Antonio! <laughs> I'm so sorry I had to leave early. Uh, did he win? Shh, was there ever any doubt? I'm the best there is. Ah, you should have seen him. <laughs> <laughs> Magnifico! Maria. We have to talk. Alone. No problem, Mr. V, Mrs. V. I'll show Tony what I'm working on. Take good care of him, Samantha. I always do. Come on, champion of the world. Ugh, this should be real exciting. What is the matter, Jorge? We have a problem, Maria. Muy grande. We're focusing our efforts on nanotechnology, the ability to build products of any size with atomic precision. We're developing nanobots that will work on the molecular level in the bloodstream and act as an adrenaline booster. And I'm studying the possibility of using these same nanobots to promote self-healing. With any luck at all, these breakthroughs will be a huge benefit to man. Sounds, uh, great. I didn't mean to bore you with my research and all. Oh, come on. You know I couldn't care less about this junk. Yeah, I know. It's all about Tony. Uh, look, I gotta get some sleep. Tomorrow's match and everything, huh? Right. See you then.
I don't understand what this all means. It's only a matter of time before the police find out about the illegal experimentation on humans. There's going to be some serious trouble. Put your hands behind your head! Drop to the ground! Now! We need stronger test subjects. Not a problem. I think I know exactly where to find them. What about the cash? Forget about it. This was just intended as a test. There's more money than that to be gained if we succeed. That was jamming. You got that right. Whoa. I'm tanking. See you guys tomorrow. All right, be cool, dude. Yeah. Hey, let's go ride some rails. Yeah, just don't sack it like you did last time. <laughs> These should do perfectly. What you talking about, man? Yeah, dorkwad. Ah! Uh, uh, uh. Today's the big race? Something like that. I'd really like to talk to you later about possibly going back. You're so smart. All your professor says. Sorry, Papa. I'm perfectly happy with what I'm doing. But you could help us do so much good for the world. Good? You hypocrite. The only help you need is help staying out of prison. What are you talking about? You're afraid the police are going to find out about your illegal activities. That's not true! You don't understand! We were- Can it! Let's roll out. Yo, Smith! He must have overheard us talking yesterday. What do you mean? He misunderstood and thinks we're the ones doing something illegal. <gasps> what are we going to do? Before there are any more misunderstandings, we need to talk to Nigel. You should have a chance to explain. Let's go. Everything will work out for the best. I'm sure you're right. Our seventh round is about to Our exciting show will Oh, damn it, I'm gonna be late. Hurry up, cuz. You don't wanna miss me kicking Z-Man's butt. Uh, sure, Tony. I'll be right with you. Z-Man, you're the East Coast champ, but Tony's the best in the West. You really think you can beat him? Man, I'm not only gonna beat him, I'm gonna mash, rip, and fry him. When this thing is over, Tony Valdez is gonna be one flat tortilla. Tell him, lady. Z-Man, the greatest! Z-Man, the greatest! Tony, did you hear? Berto and Filippo were missing. Last night, we were grinding on some rails. They never went home, dude. Nah, they'll show. They won't want to miss me tweaking that poser. Whoa, I was hoping to see you again. Oh, don't worry. I told you, I'm making you a superstar. Your future is gonna be my life mission. With fringe benefits, of course. Hey, Tony! How about an interview? Well, why not? Tune this up for me, will ya? Si, jefe. So, why is a babe like you hanging with a loser like him? Hey! When there's a real man available. 
The only loser here is you. Oh, all right, you win. You want a victory kiss? What an ass. Thanks for noticing. Oh. I really think you're overreacting, George. Are you denying you authorized testing on human subjects? There are always acceptable losses when a scientific breakthrough is this close. These aren't acceptable losses. These are human beings! And now, the race you've been waiting for. Long-time rival, Tony Valdez and Z-Man. Face off in our final competition. I have buyers ready right now that will pay us more money than any of us could ever have hoped to see in our lifetimes. We just need to be ready when they are. That's not why we started this company. I wouldn't do anything rash if I were you. Valtec Robotics and your reputations will suffer if this gets investigated. That's a chance we'll have to risk. We will not be accomplices in murder. We're going to the police. Goddamn self-righteous humanitarians. Taipan, I was just thinking of you. I think they're going to be a problem. Nothing our new recruits can't resolve. didn't break, which means the wheels couldn't fall off, unless the bolts messed with. I'm going to kill him. Yeah? Tony Valdez? Yeah, I'm Tony Valdez. Your parents were in a car accident. <gasps> they need your help. No, that can't be. My father's a careful driver. What did it happen? The flood control channel near Highway 14. Give me your keys.
esto, Felipe? Oh, crap. I'm staying with him. You can go get some sleep. I'll call you when I have some news. What happened to your eye? Ah, uh, it's nothing. I, I just fell, huh? Hey, call me later. Of course. Everything's on schedule for our meeting. Mm-hmm. Exactly. Well, it seems my new guinea pigs are working out just fine. They're definitely able to handle the stress a lot better, but I'm not sure for how long. Just as long as they make it till Thursday night. After that, I couldn't give a damn what happens to them. There still seems to be a few loose ends. Hmm? So, uh, you had quite a night. The doctor says you're going to be okay now. Oh no! Ah! Oh, this is so hard for me. The doctor said he said there's a good chance that you may never walk again. <gasps> but Tony, I've been thinking about it, and I think if I utilize the nanotechnology research Voltec has been doing, and I adapt- Stop it! Just shut it! Just leave me alone. Hey, I'm glad you came back. Of course. You're my superstar. All you need is some TLC. And I'll take care of you like nobody else can. Mm, you're just what I needed. I'm so sorry, Tony. Your parents were wonderful people. I, I couldn't have asked for better partners. Muchas gracias, Nigel. Have the police found anything? No. They think it was just an accident. But I know Berto and Felipe uh, must Tony, have... Tony, I hate bringing this up right now, but 
I was wondering if your parents ever mentioned the research that they were working on. I never really care what they did, Nigel. Yes, uh, well, uh, you see, I can't seem to figure out what their last few experiments were. You know, now that they're dead, I can't see as how it really matters. Do we need to talk about this now? No, uh, of course not. So, how are you doing? Let's see. My parents just died. The doctors say I'll never walk again. I guess the rates are great. They were such good, kind people. They always made me feel like I was a part of Tu Familia. I was so thrilled when they allowed me to stay in their guest house. And I just... Uh, this party is just too depressing. Really? Is this any way for a superstar to spend his afternoon? Right. Um, Sammy, you remember Valeria, don't you? You almost got away from me. Well, I wouldn't want to do that. Don't worry, sweetie. I'll have you up and ready for therapy in the morning. Now you take good care of my Tony. I have special plans for him. Hola, guapa. Oh, so cuz, where's this physical therapy dude? <laughs> I was watching the sunset. You should try to do it every day. Good for the chi. Aloha, Tony. They call me dog. You're my physical therapist? I'm Ruben, uh, Tony's cousin. Hmm. <sighs> now let's see. They've removed the fixator brace and put you in something a little more conventional. Mm, this should be a piece of cake. <laughs> and I love cake. No fooling. Hey, you're gonna hurt him. You sit down. You must have trust. Okay, let's see what you can do. You, loco? I can't walk. Hmm, you must first walk in your mind. The legs will follow. Walk in my mind? That makes absolutely no sense. I give up. Can't do it. You can't do it because you don't want to do it. Maybe this will help. Um, those look dangerous. You betcha. You might feel a little sting at first, but that should go away. What are you doing? I combined your parents' research with mine. So those pinpricks you felt, they're computer probes dispersing nanobots into your bloodstream that are designed to knit your torn tissue and broken bones. Robots? Um, if somebody stop her? She's putting robots in me? Oh, grow up. I said nanobots. As the level of power increases, you can adjust the power level remotely. Your strength will increase, and these sensors will register and anticipate every move you make, and will compensate for balance and weight distribution, so falling's not even a possibility. 
Uh, Sammy, en inglés, por favor. Tony's wobble, but they won't fall down. Hey, this actually works. Of course, it's still experimental, and you shouldn't increase the power too much. And you'll need these for a while. <laughs> Very cool. It's as if he's had the benefit of six months of my therapy already. Thank you. I still want to do some more experimenting, but these should do for now. Come on, let's test out these babies. What's wrong? I was on my way to being a superstar, but now look at me. You're on your feet again. How wonderful. What else can you do again? Why don't we go and find out? Mm. Mm. Mm, I've got really big plans for you. Oh, uh, thank you for bringing him to me, Jimmy. That's Sammy. Guska. You want me to steal his crutches and beat her over the head with him? You. Haven't you done enough damage? Get away from me. Hey, he walks out on you and I'm scum? You sabotaged his wheels. Excuse me? No way. I beat him fair. Well, I would have if he hadn't have slammed, but I had nothing to do with his mechanical malfunction. Look, let me buy you a coffee. Get to know the real me. No, thanks. I've seen the real you. No, that's all just an act. Sponsors love bad boys. And the better Z-Man is, <laughs> the more endorsements I get. Zeb Zuberman. Now, with 50% less evil. <laughs> okay, Zeb, now with 50% less evil. <laughs> Let's go get some coffee. Ah, my new wild riders. Strong and virile athletes. In spite of all that, they still won't last long. At least long enough for us to get rich and out of the country. You're nothing like what I thought you were. Thanks for being such a good listener. My pleasure. See, Z-Man! I really, you are really, awesome. really, 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 I'm so excited to be here. Oh my god, oh my god. Here, Simon, please. Awesome. I really want you. I don't know how it's been so long. I don't know how it's been here for so long. Ah! Me too. What do you want me to sign? Oh, sorry. Maybe next time. Ooh, you are so sexy when you're mad. Shut up. Come on, Tony must have told you how beautiful you are. Yeah, right. <laughs> Man, he's a bigger ass than I thought. These computer sims show the nanotechnology and DNA regeneration project your parents were working on before their untimely death. It appears the project was dangerously flawed. In fact, if they had ever tested this on a live subject, it would have resulted in death. Apparently your parents were planning to hide that fact so they could sell it privately. I'm sorry I'm the one who has to show you this. I don't understand. Why would they do this? Did you know Valtec had lost its government contracts? And the federal grants had long since run out? And that's why I'd been brought in as a partner initially. Tony! That's not true. Look, I don't know why you're saying these things, but there's no way- Sammy, stop. I overheard that. I'm pretty sure they did test this technology and they were worried about the police finding out. No, I don't believe it. I'm afraid they might have been trying to leave town when they had their accident. Give me time. Let me check the data. Maybe okay. I... Okay. You can look into it. But I don't want their names evolving a scandal. And you shouldn't either. They're gone. You can stop lurking about. He's definitely outlived his usefulness. Should I kill him now? You better make that 
both of them. This hurts. Good. <laughs> now go faster. So, where's Miss Silicon? I hear Oz wants to sell her a new brain. Trust me, she ain't Miss Silicon. She's Miss Natural. Remind me to laugh later. Look, I don't know why I'm doing this, but here. A skateboard. Huh, what a perfect gift for a person that can barely walk. And here I thought you had no sense of humor. No, you idiot. Just watch. This is something brand new. I built it with circuitry that perfectly complements your new braces. There's also magnetic grip tape, nanoglide trucks, RPM booster neoprene wheels, recess grips for melon and milk grabs, and it even folds up flat for easy storage. I also designed a new helmet with night vision, amplified acoustics, cell phone, and a remote to help control the power in your boots. Mm, why did you do all this? Yo, Sammy! Why is he here? You almost ready? Our reservation's for eight. Fancy, a reservation. Okay, tipazo. Just a minute. You thought you'd never skateboard again, so I designed something even a baby couldn't fall off. I'm not a baby. I don't need you to help me walk or skate or do anything else. Comprende? The body heals only after the mind heals. What the hell is that? Sushi wisdom? <laughs> no good reason ever to be angry. Really? Let's see. I've inherited a company I know nothing about. The two guys who jumped me are still running around. Nobody seems to care. And if I wasn't wearing these things, I couldn't even walk. That's already three good reasons to be pissed. You want more? Sit. I don't want to. Okay, sitting is good. Ten years ago, in Maui, there was a champion surfer. He rode the waves like Duke Kahanamoku himself. There was no one better. But then something happened, and he can surf no more. Yeah, what? Gamblers wanted him to lose a big competition. He said no, and he rode to win. They tried to kill him, but failed. He wanted to hurt them back, but his body was too broken. The bad man got away. Life's a bitch. He felt sorry for himself. He thought the world hated him, but he met a beautiful wahini. And soon he learned he did not have to feel sorry all the time. And then his body healed. Today, he serves. Today he is happy. The body cures only after the mind heals. Works every time. <laughs> Okay, that's gotta hurt. Hey, Ruben, where are you going? Uh, I'll see you later. I got business. <gasps> Berto? Filippo? Where have you guys been? Take them. What happened to that? 
down. I don't know. Let's find out. I have two more. Don't worry about Valdez. Tony? I have special plans for him. Yeah. Tony, it's Frag! And Scrag! Some gang attacked us! And Berto and Filippo were with them! Berto and Filippo? And one of them was talking about you! Where are you? The skateboard park. <laughs> Frag! Scrag! Take them with the others! The hell you will! What? Uh. This is none of your business now! Back uh. off! Uh. Make it in my business! Uh. Uh. You can consider yourself lucky! Stay out of my way! I think you guys are safe now. This is so cool and awesome. Wait till we tell everyone. You've just made a very dangerous enemy. Launcher to bust into a pawn shop? Talk about a little overkill. Ugh. I could get used to this. That's 50 to you, Omri. Hey, I'm all in and another two G's. Uh, if you'll uh, spot me. Uh, I don't know. I don't want your big shot cousin coming down on me. Ah, uh, don't worry about him. He ain't got no huevos anymore. He's just a gimp. Muy bien, you're covered. Show. Ha! Full boat! Jacks over sixes! I win! Not so fast. Four kings. Okay, pay up. What? Uh, 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 how'd you, uh... Uh, you're not accusing me of cheating, are you, bro? Me? No. No, of course not. It's no problem. You'll get your money. 24 hours. Man, I'm glad you called. Me too. You sure seem to be recovering quickly. What type of physical therapy are you doing? Uh, you wouldn't believe me if I told you. I have an idea. I have the most incredible beach house. Why don't we go after dinner? Warm water in the moonlight? 
Nobody for miles. You don't even need a swimsuit. Sounds, uh, perfect. You have no idea. Mm -mm. I'll be right back. Okay. Valdez, I'm the one who murdered your father and mother. Murdered? Who is this? Ten minutes, 17th and Brewster. Hello? Hello? <laughs> when my date comes back, tell her something came up and I had to leave. <sighs> Dios mío. I've been set up. That felt good. Number two coming up. Ouch. That looks sharp. It's payback time. You again. Where did you hide from this? like his parents, Valdez found himself a skateboarding bodyguard. Now you're getting personal. Oh, I am so gonna sell this for a gazillion bucks! Ah, uh, now that's not fair. Shut up! Now that really hurts. Didn't anyone ever teach you manners? Gotcha! Thank you, Mr. Uh, uh, you can call me the Condor. Thank you, Mr. Condor. Isn't over. You can count on it. Uh. Sorry, pal, but I think I'm going to need this. What the hell happened here? new hero fighting what witnesses insist were zombie-like skateboarders. Another bystander says he calls himself the Condor. He risked his own safety to save my granddaughter. All fled as police arrived, leaving the body of one of the skateboarders. He was declared dead on the scene due to a massive heart attack and a oh. brain aneurysm. Oh. Tony! Dios! What happened? Uh. I think it might be time these boots had a tune-up. Damn skateboard clown helped him escape from you again? I'll deal with his bodyguard later. 
mass for Valdez. I already have that plan in motion. You better have. And you better find a replacement for that rider you lost. Trust me. I've got that covered. Ah, uh, Sammy, a prisa. What's taking so long? You have any idea how long it takes to build these things? I need to get going. The snake guy killed my parents before they could talk to the police. I have a score to settle with him. Oh. So you no longer think that we're running away? It's about time. I know, but I, I couldn't see what was perfectly obvious to you. Could have been involved in anything illegal. Ah, ow. There might be hope for you yet, Antonio Valdez. Um, hey, I almost forgot to show you this. I took this off of Berto. Hmm, that's strange. This is very similar to something we were developing at Valtech. Ese, I was looking for you, Tony. Uh, I need 2,000 bucks. Like right now. Whoa, what type of trouble are you in? Uh, I did something really stupid, and Chato says he's gonna cut me real bad if I don't pay up. Tony, por favor. No, man. Chato is bad news. He doesn't want your money. He wants to own you. You're turning me down? Come on, cuz. We're familia. You can't. Trust me. You need to go to the police. No. You don't understand, okay? I can't drop a dime on him. That'll get me killed. You have to get out of that neighborhood. I can help you. It's too late, man. They jumped me into the gang. I'm a member. Let me help you. Help me? You never helped me. All you ever did was get me in deeper. I ain't surprised that you're useless now. Man, I'm glad I screwed with your board and made you lose that stupid meat. Man, I cannot believe it was him. Ah, oh, hell. Maybe I deserved it. I should have helped him get out of that neighborhood before it was too late. You can't save everyone, Tony. They have to want to be saved. Okay. You ditched me at the restaurant. Where'd you go, lover? Um, I'm sorry. Uh, something came up. Well, you can make it up to me by coming to my beach house, like you promised. Um, right. Um, I'm sorry, Val. I forgot. We really need that interview. The magazine is waiting to be sent to the printers. Sure, I can be there. I did promise, and I can't just blow her off because it's inconvenient for me. Could I? No, no, of course not. Look, I'm sorry. This won't take long. Great. Now he suddenly becomes someone you can depend on. Hi, Val. I'm sorry, I... I didn't realize the interview couldn't wait. Of course it can wait. I can't. What's the matter, baby? Do you really need to be interviewed to come see me? So, how about that swim you promised? Sure. Good idea. Oh, a little nervous. I'm sure a nice moonlight swim is just what the doctor ordered. Afterwards, we can get nice and comfortable, so I can finish my job. You? It's you? Well, now, what have we here? That's what I get for trying to mix business with pleasure. <laughs> Thought you'd be even easier to kill than your parents were. I guess I shouldn't have let you out of my sight for a minute.
Did that homely little bitch design these? Is that how she shows her love for you? from <laughs> one should always walk softly and apologize to the air molecules as you disturb them I was hoping to find Tony here okay well he's not here right now he's with Valeria what are you studying Sammy I'm remotely accessing the computers at Baltech to figure out what tests were being conducted hmm DNA the building block of life and that's what it normally looks like. This is it after it's been altered with nanotechnology. Wait a minute. The DNA pattern that all these tests were conducted on... ...were Mr. Valdez's, Tony's father. It looks as if all these nanobots were designed to work specifically with Mr. Valdez's DNA. If these nanobots are introduced to anyone else's DNA... It would put pressure on heart and adrenals. Brain functions would be rerouted, heart is put in stress, would cause death for sure. You're right. A test subject could live, what, one, two weeks max? And that's only if the nanobots aren't induced to full power. Isn't this the same technology you used on Tony's boots? I never suspected they'd be a problem. I'm gonna run a sim on Tony's DNA. Because his DNA is so similar to his father's, it seems his system should be able to handle the nanobots better. Unless he powers them up too high or for too long. How do you know all this? <sighs> I read before bed. I have to make a phone call. I told you I'd take care of you like no one else could. <laughs> what are you hiding from? Ah, where'd you come from? Did Tony send you? Tony? Please, he's a wimp. It's you I've always been attracted to. Uh, me? You're messing with me. No, I couldn't stand the way he treated you. I've got an idea how we could get back at Tony. Uh-huh. Not you. Come on. 
Look, that little girl would do anything in the world for you. And I'd do anything for her. Sammy? So when she asked me to keep an eye on you, I couldn't refuse. Next time, use both your eyes. Why doesn't it surprise me that Nigel's behind all this? Dios mio. He's planning on selling the formula to terrorists. Tonight! He will have to be stopped. <laughs> I knew you had it in you. Come on, lover. Let's go. So I can use the power that these boots give me and try to stop Nigel. And take a chance that the nanobots will kill you. Or let Nigel get away with selling my parents' technology and causing worldwide terror. I choose option A. We are here as agreed. Where is this wonderful thing you promised? I assume you have the money? It will be wired to your offshore account as soon as we are satisfied. Excellent. I thought a little demonstration might be in order. the meaning of this? Just my way of demonstrating the profound capabilities of what you're agreeing to purchase. All is going exactly as I planned it. Exactly. You uh, have a deal. Why are the funds? <sighs> you will not be sorry, gentlemen. I can personally guarantee that this will make you the most powerful. It's amazing how stupid some people can be. I'm sorry, gentlemen. There's been a slight change of plans. Tony, what's going on? There's been a few interesting developments. I'm going to have to go in right now. We're almost there. Sorry, Chica. Can't wait. Nigel was such a small thinker. I'm going to keep this technology for myself. But for a fee, I will supply you with as many soldiers as you might need. Call for three times the amount to ensure I won't be too quick to offer my services to your enemy. sure the job was finished. This time I will. Ah, uh, now you've got to hurt my feelings again. Get him. Oh man! You're a 
a girl. Girl or no girl. That's one tough chick. That's the old Tony I know and love. That's not gonna stop me. Well, would you look at that? have just walked away, but you had to be a superstar! A month ago, I probably would have walked away, but not now. Not ever again! What a waste. So long, lover. It's been a blast! Will my grandchild survive? I do not know. The child is hurt very badly. There is nothing I can do. Use this. It will save me. Selfishness that I never had the chance to make it right between us. But you need to know, even when we argued, even when we fought, I knew you two were the most important people in my life. You see, first mind, then body. Well, <laughs> in your case, first body, then mine. And a good wahini. <laughs> Ruben, espera. What do you want? We shouldn't end this way. Guess Tony Valdez doesn't always get what he wants. You've done everything you can. It's up to him now. If I were you, I'd listen to her, amigo. You got yourself a good one. 
but just cause you got the girl don't make you a better skater than me, dude. Don't bet on it. <laughs>